Hey, what's up, guys? This is Nick from Kid Safe Gaming, and today I'm going to play some Shovel Knight, uh, the Steam version. Love this game. Um, just let me put it in real quick. Okay. This is a great, um, it's a newer game, but it feels very retro. I love it. It controls awesome. Um, it's right in the same vein as the Mega Man and uh, all the great 8-bit games that I grew up on. So I'm going to skip through the intro and just get right into it. Basically, you just, uh, you're just you a guy who has a shovel. There he is, Shovel Knight. And you dig up gems. And you can kind of hop on your shovel like uh, Scrooge McDuck would on his cane and ducktails. Or you can just use it as a, as a weapon. And you basically get as much uh, money as you can and try to find as many hidden secrets as you can and beat the boss and stuff like that. I don't know too much about this game. I've never, I've definitely not beaten it. Um, I haven't played it too much. I've played the uh, first few levels a lot of times. So I just wanted to give you a little gameplay, show you what it's, uh, what it's like. This is a little lamp that's like a, a checkpoint. This reminds me of Mega Man 2 so much. This reminds me of Mega Man 1, reminds me of the Fireman stage. Ooh, that was close. Some walls reveal enemies, some walls reveal gems. You never know. That is a sheet of music, which I believe I bring to some guy in town. Oh, man. Still, yeah, sweet. I don't need to do all this, I just want to see if I'm missing any great gems. I've never done all of them before. Okay, now I know. See what's up here. Oops. Got ahead of myself. Paid the price. Nice. 
I just tried to duck. I guess you can't duck in this game. It's funny, you get used to ducking and double jumping and stuff like that, and then you try it in the game, and it doesn't work. And it can be really bad. I don't know how many it takes. Seven? It takes seven. I don't want to be over the uh, gap here when I defeated him because I would beat him and then fall right into it. So I'm going to make sure. Still sick like two and a half, three weeks later. I guess going to the doctor would probably help. Who has time for that? Plus, there's a huge snowstorm going on outside right now. It's crazy. Like 14 inches, maybe. Uh, okay, I was going to say, how do I get up there? But I can jump just high enough to get back up there. He jumps pretty high. Okay. I wonder what I'm missing over here. Did I already do this part? gold. I think the boss is right around the corner. He is not easy. Yes. That was not easy. For the first boss, that was pretty tough. So I think this will bring me into town. I'll just show you a little bit of town after he sleeps for the night. up. Gotta dig up the campfire. Feat accomplished. Only you. Alright, the clouds move and there's the town. Halt! No weapons! We have enough to worry about here lately without everyone swinging swords around. Oh haha, <laughs> that's no weapon. Just the shovel. You may enter. Then. And don't forget press up to talk to everyone okay you should press up to talk to people like you just did now all right well I know I need to talk to this guy hail traveler I am but a simple bard and I have a big problem I've lost all my music sheets my entire repertoire lays scattered across the land if you ever find a music sheet return it to me and I shall reward you handsomely Ooh, you have a music sheet please accept 500 gold as a reward yes wonderful Let's see here. Oh, you found Strike the Earth. Ah, Ost Ost Ostinato Trumpet Triplets. Is there anything you can't render into pure magic? Now that I have this music sheet, I can perform it for you at any time. Just ask. 
Alright. Can I get up here? Can I jump off there? Yeah. Pottage and poultry, mutton and meat. Your maximum health will increase if you eat. Bring a meal ticket, I'll whip up the feast. Go to Titian, might have some. Now where is that sly beast? Alright, so that's where I go to uh, get some health. What's this guy gonna say? Ah, uh, decisions, decisions. Should I extend my magic or health or just eat a tin can? Why not buy a meal ticket and help narrow my options? Alright, well, that guy's got a meal ticket, but I don't need that right now. Let's see what's down here. Ah, new face. Dancers, acolytes, witches, goats. Everyone's welcome in here. Alright, I'm just gonna go by and see what's over here or anything. Sigh. I suppose peaceful solitude is too much to ask for. Well, as long as I'm stranded here, shall we pass the time with a little game? I'll just need a hundred gold first. Eh, I'm all set. I won't be doing that right now. So let's see what's over here. Hmm. Psst. Hey, blue guy. You wouldn't believe the merchandise I've got for you today. Why not have a look? Alright, well. That guy's selling stuff. Hello, fish friend. All hail the Truple King. Who? You've never heard of the Truple King? Half trout and half apple? Pronounced like mouthful. Oh, trouple. He's one of the Force Gods, here to help those in need. I'm telling the truth. If you ever visit the Sacred Grotto, hold your chalice aloft, and the tr Truple King will appear. Truple King will appear. As it happens, I've been entrusted to sell Truple chalices to believers. Would you like one? No. I'm all set. I'm not going to talk to this guy. Oh, yes I am. Hey, Shovel Knight, I know things are tough, but don't throw in the towel. Alright, well that was... I guess good to know, but... Scroll down. Wow, Mr. Knight, nice stick. Come on, let's play. Oops. Uh, that's something. And the music sheet. And another chest. Cool. So anyway, that's Shovel Knight. Just gives you the basic overview of it, um, how it plays, and um, it's super retro, and it's a lot of fun. It handles really well. Um, and it's worth the money. I don't know how much it is on Steam right now, but uh, definitely check it out if you like uh, retro type uh, games like this. So that's it for tonight. Thanks. I'll see you tomorrow. And uh, yeah, take care.